One of the ways React makes components easier to build is something called JSX. JSX is a JavaScript extension language that feels like you're putting HTML straight in your JavaScript. Ah! Oh. It makes HTML a first-class citizen of your JavaScript code, which means you can get your hands right in there and get dirty with your HTML, which is what your web app is actually outputting. There's still some debate over JSX and whether it's a good idea, but I really like it, so I'm gonna show you how it works. This part here is JSX. As you can see, it's basically just like HTML. I can write a paragraph here and say, this crazy fox, it renders here as this is a crazy dog, blah, blah, blah. And it's a paragraph. I can add attributes and say, well, the style attribute is a little special. We can talk about that later, but we have to say color red. We can say href, HTTPS, Google, and it becomes a normal link that you can click on and it says Google. Because this JSX is actually JavaScript, you can also assign it to variables. So you can say const link equals this stuff. I am literally assigning an HTML value to a variable or a constant in this case, and I can render it here in curly braces and it shows up. I can actually execute any sort of expression in, inside curly braces. So I can say one plus five, and that's gonna render a six. And on top of that, you can also assign various event handlers like click handlers, hover handlers, all sorts of things. And behind the scenes, it's all compiling down to JavaScript functions called create element, which isn't really important. It's just an implementation detail. The important part is that you have HTML that you can control directly with JavaScript and manipulate as a first-class citizen in your code, which is exactly what you want.